Okay, I think we had enough of this war in the north business here. Chide's been getting raided. Uh, well, welcome back, guys. <laughs> We're back. And, uh, yeah, Chide has been raided by some Nordish, uh, rebels here. Uh, just going here, looting it. Just got a message about it. I don't like it one bit. It's time to go back to the homeland. Time to take care of Durham. And, uh, and all that kind of stuff, because, I mean, yeah, we're, we're taking over, we're conquering stuff up here, it's fun, but, you know, we're getting, like, we're getting, like, taken apart down below, down south, so, alright, what we got here, uh, yeah, I guess I do need a horse, uh, it seems like these guys pretty much have the, uh, situation handled up here, what do we have for quests? Oh, that's right, visit girlfriend, okay, we could tell her about, I think, that guy that we beat, right, didn't we beat someone in a duel? I'm not sure, no, I don't think so, but whatever, we'll visit her. Uh, maybe even get married, run away, get married, make an enemy of, uh, of Tradian because he's being a big old m meanie old guy. He <laughs> doesn't want us to, like, hang out. Um, what the heck? Oh my gosh, Kingdom of Nords offers you some of 5,100 dinars in silver if you're willing to sell them. Yeah, man, take them, whatever. Oh, that's right, we got tons of prisoners, too, up in here. Uh, from all the Nords <laughs> with that we've been raiding, so that's good. I'll be selling these guys, like, hotcakes, uh, on a on a hot day, so, alright, uh, moving down south, sp uh, splitting away from the rest of the pack, and trying to, uh, defend and cultivate the homeland, uh, hopefully, and maybe, like, get ourselves a darn horse, cause, like, I'm tired of, like, walking around. Getting into a little bit of a tussle, oh my goodness gracious, these guys are fast, and they are kicking the crap out of me, there we go, uh, get that, there we go, take that, I'm fighting this whole army, get out of here, this is, this is my army. There we go. Are you are you dead? Oh my gosh, these poor horses. Look at them, they're all piled up like that. Okay. Anyway, we're helping out uh, a man. Uh, I think what one of our Swadian fellows, uh, lords. Uh, we're helping him out with a little fight here. Why is everyone just standing there? <laughs> I guess I kind of told him to stand there. That's all right. Let's take all these guys on. These angry nords. Uh, just for a little warm up, a little bit of practice. Oh, these guys getting hit. There we go. I'll take that little sword slash. You gotta block yourself, buddy. All right, let's go for. Oh, he's blocking. Somehow got through. That's the wrong kind of block for that, sonny boy. Yeah, there we go. Oh, you got a hit on me. That's good. We'll, we'll give him a, a good head slash like that. Got some hits there. He wasn't ready for that. And we have won the battle. Okay, good. Nice little warm up. Uh, but yes, we're still hitting the Durham and looking for a horse. Upgrading our troops. We're making so much money now. Um, one more out. Yay. Yes, this was the fellow right here. He's, he's very happy. He's very happy of uh, something. Okay, so let's... Uh, uh, oh, do I want any of these guys? I too, I want, yeah, let's grab, <laughs> let's grab this little guy. Okay, cool. So, yeah, whatever. Uh, yeah, let everyone loot everything. That's good. Okay, so, we are here, moving up. Uh, looking to hire some more people. And people have been hired. People are now being trained. Okay, so we got our peasants here. Uh, whole tons of peasants. We're going to train these guys up into archers. Uh, mercenary swordsmen, these guys are just gonna hang around to defend our, uh, lower ranks. And then a whole bunch of archers up here, uh, ready for deployment. I'm setting the guys I, uh, I, I like the least, uh, up front. Like, <laughs> it's funny, we actually got some Nord guys here. But whatever, okay, so we're gonna be training these guys up. I need to figure out how to access, access our treasury, because that last, um, uh, ransom that was paid to us went to our treasury. I don't know where the heck that is. Uh, meanwhile, we are visiting girlfriend. Um, yeah, let's attempt to visit a lady. Oh, the guards are still glaring at us. What in the heck? Man, I'm so sick of this. I'm so sick of this whole thing, like, like trying to, like, make Tradian like us and all this whatever. Um, I don't know. I, I, might, I might just elope. Then again, I like being single right now, so <laughs> we'll see. I don't know what's going to happen. I think I, uh, one of you said I need a castle or something like that before uh, she's going to, like, oh my gosh, how happy I am that you could come. Uh, so delightful to have a chance to spend some time with you. I'm glad to see you. Trust you're having some success out there, making a name in the world. Oh, she actually really does care about us. That's so sweet. Because, uh, she sees a future together with us, doesn't she? Yeah, yeah, okay. Well, yeah, perhaps I'll change your father's mind. We'll see. I guess I'll talk to him again. I'll do missions for him, and I'll do missions for our city as well. Uh, let's, let's, uh, let's at least see. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I don't think he's here, actually, in, in the hall. But, uh, but anyway, let me show you guys our income that's coming in, uh, right about here. It's, it's totally nuts. Yeah, we actually have, like, 3k, uh, assets in, uh, in Praven. Weekly budget is off the charts. I mean, look at this, so much money. Chide is just, like, getting destroyed, looted, ransacked by those Nords. Uh, we'll, we'll have to bash them up some more in the neighborhood. I'm, I'm looking for some more fighting, but yeah, I mean, we're making lots of money. Time to go ahead, uh, garrison our, uh, market town over here. 
And yeah, that's gonna be uh, that's gonna be real sweet. So, all right, training up the troops as we run on over. And there's a Budlandian flag waving over Durham. <laughs> it's uh, so cool. Look at this. Okay, let's go home. Wow, there's my face. I own this place. Okay, cool. Um, let's let's go ahead. First things first. We gotta build uh, a bar here. Gotta build a bar. Uh, where's this guild master? Uh, and then we're also going to accept a, a quest from him as well. Good day, Bud Kai. What can I do for you? I'd like to set up a productive enterprise. Let's make an ale house. I don't care about the market or, uh, or what's cheap or what's good. Let's just build a brewery because uh, I want to have one in every, uh, every town everywhere. Uh, as long as we're not losing money. Upkeep. Okay, cool. So we'd actually make like 200 dinars a week. Yeah, here's the money. Do it up. Just, just do, it, do all that stuff. Now we need to find a uh, treasurer around here so we can access our funds because we've been getting paid by all these random sources but I don't know where this money is really going to so I'm going to um, see if I can find someone who has our money. So it looks like we've stumbled upon an epic quest here with our guild master in Durham. Uh, he's saying that, uh, well pretty much the whole conversation was going that this war needs to end between us and the Nords. And, uh, and we need to convince Baron Devlin and Jarl uh, Favrio Olaf, I think I've captured him once actually, we have to convince them to accept a peace settlement because they are the major players on both sides, our side and the Nord side, that want this war to continue. They are the uh, war mongerers. So we have to either capture one of them or, uh, or talk sense into Devlin. So alright, I'm going to go ahead and do this quest and, uh, and if, if we actually do this we get 12,000, 12,000 dinars. That's crazy. So yeah, let's do it. And if we do this, the city will like us more, and our, our whole, uh, I guess, uh, profits will, will increase. So it's a, it's a win-win deal. Um, yes, we'll take care of these two old goats. <laughs> All right. And we have entered my castle chambers with the flag of Budlandia waving proud and free. Uh, now what the heck is going on around here, and where's my money? There's a chancellor and a, and a chamberlain. And is this the guy that empties my chamber pot? I don't know. All right, let's, let's talk. Milord. Oh, I like this guy already. <laughs> Milord. All right. Um, so let's talk about domestic policy. Oh, my goodness gracious. Require information about a lord. What's the mood of everyone? Oh, my goodness. Wow. Okay. Um, let's, 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 talk about, let's talk about money, man. Where's, where's my money? Oh, and I just saw the little message pop up just below. So this guy's all about, like, showing us our household stuff. Check it out. You can actually check out your household possessions, which we have nothing in here, but these are things that you could send around for gifts. And here's our money. I'm like, how do I get this money? How do I get this money? And then a little message popped up. Uh, let me tell this guy goodbye. Uh, yes, here we go. Let's open this. What the heck? Where's my money? <laughs> what the heck? There's nothing in here. Oh, my goodness. What? Put it. Oh, here we go. Here's the money guy. Here's the money guy. Yes. Yes. Give me. Give me everything. <laughs> give me. Give me everything. Uh, all of it. All of it. Okay, good. Now. Now let's build like a ton of breweries and train our troops. Thank goodness. And I've also discovered that Chide is occupied by outlaws. How outrageous that is. We're going to go there. Liberate it. Free it. Smash them all to bits. Yes. Uh, right after we, uh, let's, let's go ahead and adjust the tax rates too. This, this man is fantastic. This is, this is the best man ever. Actually, I think this is the same guy that was hanging out in Chide, like, behind, uh, the barn. But now he's here, now I can easily talk to him. Uh, so, so, uh, for Chide, yeah, we have it set to normal. Uh, let's also set the tax rate for, uh, this, this is very, very, uh, you know, uh, stuff here. It's very good stuff. Durham, set it to, I think it's set to normal. It looks like it's set to normal since the option isn't there. Okay, good. So it's all set to normal tax rates. Uh, you can do, like, uh, improvements all around. Pretty darn cool stuff. Item pool for the household. Oh my goodness. Well, you know what? We're, we're good. We're good. So, alright. Let's go ahead, get into a fight, uh, try to get the rebels out of Chide. And also, it's not, it's not easy being uh, a lord over, over such a large province like this. So before we go ahead and take on off uh, from Durham, I'm going to go ahead and try to build up our garrison here. Uh, so, let's see, uh, how that whole thing works, uh, just so you guys can see how, how it's done. Um, yeah, how <laughs> guys gonna show you it's done, you're right. Um, alright, so, we're gonna go ahead, train up some troops now that we have all our money. Uh, still need to actually get money from Praven, but yeah, let's, let's train up, uh, our archers. Uh, these guys, I want them to be longbowmen. Not sure if I want to leave them here, but I do want to kind of cycle in some of these, uh, like, not trained people here into our fold. Train them up, then deposit them back over here. So, oh, it looks like they have some militia. I tell you what. Alright. So, I think I'm going to train up our archers to be longbowmen. It's, it's a long time coming. I've been wanting to do this for a while. So, let's do it. Just spend the money. Do it up. Let's get all these guys cracking here. Uh, oh yeah, this is, this is, uh, this is good. Okay, so right, right away. Okay, so the money's going up. Money's going down. Uh, but these guys, wow, look at them. They're pretty serious. 
And this is what it's come down to. I'm gonna go ahead and leave our most elite troops back in town. Uh, since the town, I think, uh, like, like, halves their, uh, their upkeep cost, whatever. So we got some mercenary swordsmen and all our longbowmen here waiting in Durham. Uh, okay, as a garrison. And then we have a whole bunch of ragtag, uh, pages, militia, peasants, and cops, and all those vagars and all this stuff. So, so pretty much, uh, we're gonna be a vagar, a suede, and force. Of, uh, of archers is what I want to do eventually. Then eventually, well, I, I guess we'll get a few Swadian uh, Jacobites or what? What are these guys called? What the heck are this? The upgrade of this uh, Jacobite? Yeah, yes, yeah, so we'll get like probably 30 of those guys going here as well to, to back up our mercenary swordsmen. Uh, but yeah, okay, so time to hire many more peasants, train them up as we are on the move. And yeah, all right, so now <laughs> let's go to Chide. Finally, I think we're done managing things here for a while. So now if we leave, it's gonna say we have a, a garrison of 52. Of some, uh, of some really, uh, tough guys. Okay, good. So, off we go. And just look at it. Who we have here on the horizon. It's Jarl Favriel, the guy that we need to get. Uh, but he is definitely the marshal of his realm. Uh, what's this? Uh, King Harless has decided to confer Kuraw, uh, to King Harless. Good for him. Alright, <laughs> that's pretty funny. Uh, let's see if we can maybe get this guy, uh, on us. Oh my goodness. De declared war on the Rodak Republic. Why did we declare war on- oh my goodness. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, all right. I've made peace. Okay, wow, a lot of things going on here. Uh, let's let's just get into this fight right now. We're gonna be so outnumbered, but uh, I don't like the way that they're heading to Durham, and I wanna just kind of head them off here while we still have this Baron right next to us as an ally. So let's do it. Let's get in here. Hopefully he joins in. Good, the Baron has joined in. Three enemies have joined in on this guy's side. He's like, who the hell are you? I am Bud Kai, sir. <laughs> and uh, okay, so he's talking about our fame. Uh, can we convince him to have some peace around here? Uh, let's try... Oh, 7,000. Darn, we're just short of 7,000 for peace. Darn it, and then we could have made like 12,000 if we had just like 7,000. Oh, well, well, try to persuade him. Oh my gosh, there's no way. Oh, puts off track, point of favor. Yeah, okay, there's no way. Uh, yeah, he's, he fails to see the virtues. Okay, so let's go ahead. Surrender or die. Uh, yes, the Nords really hate us. Okay, but we have 208 versus their 383. Oh my gosh, this is going to be really tough, because I think they have a lot of elite units. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Alright, let's see how this turns out. Alright, now it's the utmost importance that we find some high ground here. This is going to be a real tense battle. Looks like uh, our allies are charging ahead. Oh cool, here looks like uh, there's a hill here. Let's go ahead and tell our archers to... Um, oh my gosh, just, oh, this is a great hill actually. This is a fantastic, fantastic hill. Tell our archers to go here. Tell our infantry to go here. And, oh, looks like the enemy is already fighting. Oh, gosh, they got some elite forces up here already. Oh, my goodness, tell our, our cavalry to go ahead and charge. Uh, so they can go ahead and start fighting. And not just stand around me all day long. Where the heck? All right, let's, let's, let's see if we can, um... <laughs> oh, my goodness gracious. Oh, my gosh, here come the Nords. Oh, there's no way we're going to win this. Oh, we got a, already an arrow stuck to our... Let's get this guy. Oh, I totally missed him. These guys are heavy, too. Oh gosh, there's, I, I can't, I can't deal with all this, there's just too much, there's too many, too many guys who wanna, how come we're not hitting anybody, what the heck is going on around here? Oh, of course I get stuck, right when I said we shouldn't get that stuck, just gotta run these guys over, survive, just don't die. That guy is tough, he took a hit, he's trying to stab us, Let's see if we can get this guy over here, we just gotta take him off the flank. <laughs> I'm like scared to get close to these guys, they'll just like one shot this horse. It's like the weakest horse I could have uh, bought. It's so like... Well, you know what? This is pretty good though. At least we got some suckers going up the hill here, which is really nice. We'll just kind of make make our way through here. Look at this two-handed sword guy, or two-handed axeman here. Oh, we're getting hit by these axes. This is bad news. I can't... I'm definitely not going to be able to take this much longer. Oh my gosh, we're almost dead. We got hit. What the... F oh my gosh, we're dead. We're dead. Our whole force is dead. Everything we've loved and dreamed for is dead. <laughs> oh my gosh. The Nords are gonna- oh, they're gonna pay for this. They're gonna totally pay for this one day. Not any day soon. After they kill all our troops, uh... Oh, they're probably gonna run amok. They'll probably sack Durham or take it for themselves. Oh, I can't even watch this fight. This is gonna be terrible. We have a few archers up here doing some work, but uh, there's no way we can beat these. Their shields are to, like, make them invincible. The Nords are making short work of all our stuff. They're just destroying our stuff, smashing our stuff. All of our stuff. It's gone. It's dead, destroyed. We're probably gonna get captured. 
Can we escape? Can we? No, I'm not, I'm not gonna run from this battle. Whatever. Let's just finish this thing. Let's all just get a big ol' happy... I mean, they're, they're ha they have an uphill battle, but they're still just going through us like, like we're melted butter. Oh, that guy got a kill. Yeah, I, oh man, I don't know. Do they have any reinforcements coming anymore? We got more. I think they got more too. It actually looks like this little bit of a hill here is is a uh, is a good thing. Is a very good thing. As we're pouring out from our reserves, uh, they're they're meeting us on this this little ridge here, and they have an uphill battle. I don't think it's really making a difference though. They're they're just working their way up here like no problem. Yeah, it's pretty it's pretty no problem for them. It's a, it's a very big problem for us. Yeah. We're just running to our death. Look at all our archers just charging in, running to their deaths. Did they even have us any more reinforcements? Oh my gosh. And now we have the peasants fighting here. This is a woman with a cane. She's she's dropped. Dropped dead on the ground. I'm not seeing any reinforcements on their side whatsoever. That means they're probably just take killing all our reinforcements one after another. And that's and that's that's it. That's it. I think I think that's it. We have like three of our uh Budlandian fellows here. Oh, this sucks, man. <laughs> this is terrible. Alright, so we pretty much lost uh, probably everything that we have. We're probably prisoner. We're probably... Uh, oh, man. This is terrible. Okay, well... Yep, and they're cheering. Here they are. They are cheering. We lost 22 morale. Gained 6 morale. Okay, whatever. And, uh, okay, so we have lost... Yeah, pretty much lost everybody. Uh, our allies lost everybody. They lost uh, some people. I killed like 4 people. Whatever. Uh, we lost all our money, pretty much. Tons of money. And we're a prisoner. And here we go. Going around the landscape, and they've besieged Durham. Fantastic. <laughs> Sarcastic. Um, so they are, they are, uh, yeah, they're just totally going to destroy this place into, like, tons of little pieces. Tons of, all right, so after painful days of being dragged about as prisoner, we find our way and escape. So let's escape. Here we are. What do we got? Oh, we still have some of our uh, buddies here. We still got some buddies. At least we get to level up. This sucks, man. Although with the level up, I did put another point into intelligence and I put two points into training. So there we go. We're going to be like the ultimate trainer to uh, re-raise our forces. Uh, so that's going to be good. 260 and two-handed weapons. I guess that's capped out for now until we get better at weapon master or some nonsense like that. But yeah, alright. So I uh, might as well put some points into one-handed in case we get into any more duels. Not likely though. Um, so, alright. Just hanging in there. Uh, ready to remake a new army. That's why I put points in all these other things and not in Iron Flesh because that would do absolutely nothing for us right now. So, okay. Uh, what are we going to do about this situation? I don't know. Uh, probably just run. What the heck? Oh, we got a whole bunch of other uh, reinforcements here. Where did all these people come from? We didn't have all these uh, garrisons before. Oh, okay. I see it's Baron. Oh, he's there. He's actually like in there. Okay, we might as well go there too. Why is everything in fast motion? Let's just go here. And, okay, I guess just chill here for a while. So I've decided to send messages to all the lords and tell them to, uh, to accompany me in the field uh, as, as a last-ditch uh, hope to try to hold Durham from these darn uh, nords, these darn rebels. Um, yeah, alright, so I'm just gonna keep on doing this for everyone, and I'm just gonna tell them to come to me. And after trying to send messages to all the uh, nobles, they've all failed uh, because they've all been intercepted by enemy troops, and now we have... <laughs> We have uh, 79 troops fit for battle against 740. So let's see if we can hold, uh, negotiate. What are we, what are we gonna no negotiate with? Yeah, there's, there's nothing There's nothing we can do here. All right, so plan my battle with the, you know, whatever. Just let's join the battle. Let's do this thing. <laughs> oh gosh, this is gonna be painful. Hopefully they don't hang us. Oh my gosh, look at all those Nord shields out there. Oh, this is gonna be so painful. What the heck to do? Yeah, archers just fire at will. Oh, we got our mercenary swordsmen. We got our longbowmen. Holy cow. Um, yeah, I mean, it looks like everyone's kind of shooting. That's good. Shoot it up. Maybe I should shoot too. But they got those shields, man. Those shields make them, like, invincible, man. It's like, it makes them totally invincible. I can't... I can't penetrate. Oh, there's there's one guy without a shield. Maybe we could hit him. Pick on the... Oh, there's there's a really important-looking guy right there. There we go. We, we got him. <laughs> there may be hope for us yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, are you okay? And the men are dropping like flies faster than we're even able to drop these Nords out here. They're just dying, getting shot in the face. It's a gruesome sight. Oh my gosh, that's not, that's like a javelin in the face. Wow. Oh my gosh, these javelins are everywhere. I'm so scared. Somebody burn that thing. Let's just set torches to it. Let's light it on fire. <laughs> oh, oh, mech. Straight bow. Oh, I don't want your straight, straight bow. You can have it. Um, But yeah, they're on the way. 
Maybe I can get a shot at like that troublemaker over there. Get some shots on him before he reaches the wall. Uh, maybe. Nah, it's hopeless. It's hopeless, man. <laughs> I mean, this is just terrible. All our all our guys are dying. Our companions are getting trapped or, or, or captured or just like lost in, in the disarray of, of us being captured. I mean, oh my gosh, we got shot in the back. This is this is terrible days. Terrible days. This looks like the end. Looks like the end of Budlandia as, as, as a whole. We really have nothing left. Uh, nothing left at all to... <laughs> we just need to make like one glorious charge. Oh my gosh, are they already rushing up here? Where are these fools coming from? Look at them, look at them. They all think they're gonna take this place. Well, they're crazy! They got another thing coming. Uh, oh gosh, it's already down. It's already down. Okay, infantry. Infantry, hear, hear me. Um, don't charge, actually. Don't charge. Not yet. Alright, charge now. Charge right now. <laughs> um, yeah, there's no way, man. There's no way. There's just, they're just too tough. There's just too many shields. This is terrible. Even their peasants are like invincible. What, what the heck's going on these days? Oh my gosh. That's what I gotta do. I gotta go for the head chops. These guys are so elite. I can't even get my footing on this guy. What? Get out of here. This is my. This is literally my castle. Now get out of here. It's, I know it's not a castle. It's a town. But I get you. Get it. Is he dead? Is that guy dead? Good. More reinforcements. Come on up, boys. Let's do this thing. Let's get some knife work to be done around here. Oh, I didn't, didn't see that coming, did you, sucker? You dare stab the king, <laughs> self-proclaimed king. Hey, get out of here. Stop it. Come on, man, help me out. For crying out loud. All right, I'm just going to sit up here and just watch. I'm going to tell everybody, everybody just charge on in. Where do these guys think they're going? All right, get out of here. Get out of here. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, this looks like the end, man. I don't know. I don't know, man. This looks like the end. This could be the end of the Bud Landy and everything. Oh, gosh, this is terrible. Oh, and I die in a bloody pool of, of agony. A mess. A total mess. So, girlfriend likes me. Her dad still hates me. Lost the kingdom. Well, my kingdom. <laughs> uh, tried burning, raided, pillaged. Everyone's dead. My troops are dead. These scoundrels are, are cheering. And all that kind of stuff. Now what happens? You are quickly surrounded by guards who take away your weapons. Oh my gosh. With curses and insults, they throw you into the dungeon where you must <laughs> while away miserable days of your captivity. Okay. <laughs> well, I think that's it, guys. What the, Why are they showing me this? Oh, okay, yeah. Uh-huh. So now what happens? But guy uh, <laughs> gets hung or something. Sire, I found... Delivered a message at, oh, his answer was a negative. Yeah, he does not want to help me because he hates me because he knows I'm dating his daughter. Uh, yeah, okay, whatever. I'm not even on the field anymore. I don't even know why these people want to make it and help me out. But, uh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah this, this is game over, baby. It's the end of the world. We escaped. Here we are with, like, oh, we still have our weapon. Maybe we can still make something out of this. I don't know. <laughs> So as Budkai, Nazar, Sajad, and, Ke and Kelthi, <laughs> she was with us since the beginning. We're the only ones that are left. Oh, messenger. We got some people following us. Whatever. I don't even care anymore, man. I think I'm just going to stay neutral in this game. This is, this is the way to win the game is to stay neutral. Don't get into any wars. Who cares about anything? Get mercenary pay. Because I, I, I miss the mercenary days. Now, look at this. We have, we have the king, Heartless, fighting uh, literally like the leader of the Nords. So I think we can do this next time. We'll fight this, gain some more honor. And, uh, and some more reputation with, with the king. But I think after this, I'm going to tell the king, go get lost. And uh, we're going to start our own adventure uh, somewhere uh, somewhere else in the land. I don't know. Because, like, he's like this, this is crazy town. This is, this is absolute crazy. He can have Chide. He can have it all. I don't know. We'll see. So, uh, oh, and we do have to go back to Praven. And uh, where the heck is everything? We have to go back to Praven and get our cash because we got, like, three grand here. Uh, I think we're just going to go around, <clears throat> excuse me, and build bars everywhere. I think, <laughs> I think that might be a way to do it. Build bars everywhere, be friends with everyone, have drinks, celebrate, and, uh, and fight occasionally. We'll see. But alright, so uh, we're going to fight this off next time.